Hi friends, now we are going to talk about one very important stuff that that is very helpful on counting the number of entries on multiple tables. Okay, so you can go to always SE16 and count the number of entries, but imagine you need it for a bunch of tables and you can get it at one go. Uh, so you can go to this transaction ST13. This is our hidden treasures. Okay, and here I will choose Tana, which is table analysis. Okay, so I will choose table analysis. Okay, and I'll execute. Okay, and here if you want, you can put the field name. So what I can do is, I suppose, I want to put uh, so the field EBLN. Okay, and I put the number of entries is suppose, or I put uh, Magnar. Okay. And the table name is EKQ. Okay, so this one is particular one field. So if I go and it say is not included, which is right. Okay, so now I'll put uh, something that is different. Uh, probably uh, FRGKE. Okay, FRGKE is the release um, indicator, I think. And if I go here, it will tell me see. Number of entries for all clients is this only 322 have these. These are the different entries. Wonderful. What you can think now if I go and I put bookers. Okay. So this is like SE16H on steroids. So you can see all these things. Okay. Now if I put another entry just to see, and suppose I put um, EKORG, that's the purchasing group. Okay, right. And I'll just put EKORG and here you can see the different entries so it's really so it gives you all the combination this is wonderful now and you can uh, enter at uh, uh, and you can give the dates also this is really nice now now suppose I just want land uh, uh, how many entries are there so I can do one thing let me see whether it first I'll do EKKO EPO EKB and just to make fun I'll put KC dot right oh that's that would be fun and I'll just execute and in a matter of seconds it gave me all the entries now if you see if I I'm lazy okay what I'm going to do is I'll delete all this let me put uh, let me delete everything okay and I'll put V sec and I'll put AC Docker also and I'll execute and you'll see the number of entries there you see it's this now I'm being lazy okay does it accept wildcard and if it does then it would be a big big thing so let me do a wildcard I don't know whether it accepts wildcard three two oof. See, it accepts wildcard. I don't want to count. I'm not going to <laughs> blow up the system. So what I'm going to do is, let's do, I'll do EK star. Okay, let's make sense. And I'll just execute. And here you can see all the entries and all the POs, all the, you know, uh, tables with the number of entries. What more you can expect? That's a real, really nice nice thing that you can do and so you can do sort by entries and all those things now generic select query with distinct and group by so here you can also do filters and all those things so this is also nice the similar to sc 16 h but this one is a killer okay uh, this really helps like a lot you know and uh, suppose i if i want suppose related with bk star okay or b B S. There is a bunch of B. Oops, sorry, I didn't select the correct radio button. B sack. Oops. Oh my God, I didn't think there would be so many entries. So let me do something related with uh, Bupa. Okay, that's a new thing. Like boot, but but is for uh, business partner. And we'll just execute, and we'll see 156 entries. Oh, well, it's counting. Oops. It's not that bad so it's already 13 you know it depends upon 
the number of entries you are so there's a bunch of tables it's going through so 156 entries um, this is really nice because you can see it can and it's quite fast this is an S4 HANA system and I'm working from home but the internet speed is not probably great but still it's moving fast okay and suppose you go to 83 now we are already half 60 percent up we are hitting the 60 percent mark now and and i'm pretty sure there's lots of entries probably for the business partners thing but there are so many tables you can see probably most of these tables will be empty okay so we'll see and whenever it's slowing up probably it's because it has entries so but still it's this is a win-win for me i think so here you can see all these entries that are there so it's really nice total number of entries and everything average entries what more you can expect okay uh, so this is this is this is really 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 good and i think uh, i love this piece okay and you can schedule as bad job execute by job called the job overview so this is really nice so again st13 and we choose table analysis too and we can use all these three radio buttons that's it stay tuned to my sap channel and happy sap learning and have a great